The African Development Bank today released its 2019 edition of its East Africa Regional Outlook, effectively announcing that the region will once again be driving the continent's economic growth this year as it grows at the fastest rate of any other part of the continent. According to the bank, economic growth is forecast to remain strong at just under 6% in 2019 and 6.1% next year. The countries with the highest GDP growth forecasts, Ethiopia, Rwanda, Tanzania, Kenya and Djibouti. The service sector dominates the composition of GDP in the region averaging about 59%, followed by agriculture at 25.7%. Industry, which includes construction, was pretty tiny at about 15%. Similarly, manufactured exports stood at an average of 14.6%, indicating the absence of structural transformation taking place in the continent. The bank also highlighted a range of downside risks that could undermine economic growth and development. Topping that list, agriculture's vulnerability to climate change, a heavy reliance on primary commodity exports, think of tea and coffee, and in oil importing countries, a rise in oil prices. We'll talk about that later in the bulletin. More recent and growing concerns are persistent current account deficits and related increases in external debt. This year, the African Development Bank also chose to focus on the continent's progress in regional integration. The landmark peace and friendship agreements between Ethiopia and Eritrea in 2018 and Eritrea's agreement to establish diplomatic ties with Somalia and Djibouti are shaping regional integration in the Horn of Africa. As Ethiopia now has access to Eritrea's ports, which have diversified the country's access route to the sea and beyond. Of course, more work is needed to improve the trade and transport corridors. But the aforementioned developments, coupled with full implementation of signed integration initiatives, most notably the CFTA, will drive this needed improvements.